back to In Focus. The documentary film Good Fortune explores how massive international efforts to alleviate poverty in Africa may be undermining the very communities they aim to benefit. Viewers Caroline Turner has more. According to the producers of Good Fortune, the West has spent more than $2 trillion in charitable aid in Africa, and the money has failed to eradicate poverty. In the Kenyan countryside, Jackson's farm is being flooded by a neighboring American investor who is trying to provide work by creating a multi-million dollar rice farm. In Nairobi, Silva's home and business are demolished as part of a United Nations slum upgrading project. Director Landon Van Soest worked intimately with his subjects. Each story plays out in a very similar way to where the people that are the beneficiaries of the project feel disenfranchised. They feel that they're going to lose their home and they're not going to benefit from the project. So each of them really mobilize their community and they really strive to fight for the things that are important to them. Despite good intentions, the international aid efforts do not have the desired impact. Producer Jeremy Levine says the film's message is important. There are these tremendous resources. There are these great opportunities and you know how do we make those how, how do we take that potential and make it work on the ground and I mean that's that's the million dollar question and that's what we're exploring here with the film. The director says he is inspired by donor goodwill for Africa but it is paternalistic to assume the West knows what is best for another society. If I had a hundred million dollars to go to Africa and administer a project that I really thought would change people's lives, I think the best possible thing I could do is try to remove myself as much as possible from that money, um, really support local initiatives, support local entrepreneurs, um, and essentially create a an organization that was able to redistribute that money to people that were working on, you know, local ideas. Van So says the film will be screened in the African communities and followed with discussion forums. The film is really an effort to look at what we're doing, assess what's working and what's not, and hopefully try to find better solutions and try to um, support local initiatives and support, you know, people on the ground in the in the efforts that they have to improve their own lives. Good Fortune director Landon Van Soest says change in Africa has to come from the bottom up. Well, thanks, Caroline Turner. And on that note, we end our show today. Thanks for watching. Good night. Good night.